Hello artists. Today I'm working on the background for a Wayne Tebow picture that I'm going to make. I drew a horizon line all the way across my paper with a black marker. Anything above my black marker horizon line is the wall. And anything below my black marker horizon line is the table. And I'm going to put desserts on the table. So right now I'm finishing coloring up the pattern I have on my wall. I'm pretending that this is wallpaper. And first I made a pattern by putting lines in. A pattern is something that has to repeat. And I've got these blue lines that repeat. And then I did some purple wavy lines. Then I also made a pattern by putting in yellow flowers. And I colored those in. And now I'm coloring in all of the empty space and I'm making a pattern with color. So it goes blue, purple, blue, purple, blue. My pattern has lines. The lines are a pattern. My pattern has color. The colors are a pattern. And my pattern has shapes. The shapes are also a pattern. My wallpaper makes a pattern three different ways. How many ways can you make a pattern on your wallpaper? I'm using my color wands, but I'm using them like they're crayons, not like they're paint. And I'm just coloring this in. You can make your pattern using your markers or your crayons or if you have color ones, you can use the color ones. I am not gonna add water to this though. I'm not turning this into paint. All right, so that's the pattern for my wallpaper. Now the next step is the table. So I'm gonna create just one color for my table to be. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and just use my, hmm, I think I'm just gonna use my markers for the table. And I'm gonna choose, I think I'm gonna choose yellow. So my table is gonna be yellow. And I'm gonna color in all of this empty white space with yellow. And I'm trying to do this as neatly as possible. And I want to get all of this space colored in. It might look like I'm scribble scrabbling, but I keep going in the same direction over and over again to make my marker lines neater. I might go down the opposite direction on the sides just to make sure that's all colored in. So this is going to be the background for my Wayne Tebow dessert picture. Let me show you in my next video how I'm going to add desserts to it.